if you've ever looked around forums or social networking sites and you've gone to a section where people are posting uh, their desktop backgrounds and you've seen one and thought, yeah, that looks really nice. I want that for my own system. But you can't just go and use their one. It's got their icons and their programs running all over it and that's no good, is it? Now we need the original picture. So I'm going to show you how to get that with a little example here on the Linux News Google Plus site. So let's just find the one here. And that's the one there I was going to suggest. And wow, there's a lot going on on that background. But there's no mention of the original picture or who it is. The girl on the screen is a model from Australia. If I recall correctly, she is cool. <laughs> helpful, 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 yes. Okay, I'll show you how to actually find that. So opening up a new browser window. Now this trick works in Firefox and Chrome and, well, I don't know, maybe it does work in Apple and um, look, the offering from Microsoft. So all I simply do is open up the Google image page, drag and drop the image across there. <laughs> Easy as that. Best guess for this image, uh, um, yes, her name there. So I could click that and see what it's actually come up with. Go on the Google image search. Ah, yes, that's her right there. And if it ever brings up the small size image first, click on the more sizes and, well, now we've got quite a choice. <laughs> So there you go, quite a nice useful feature there on the Google image search. Hope you found that useful. Thanks for watching. See you later.